know the problem we trying to address it kongololchi sirik ab logoiwek eng kot ab kawi complex in south sea komwa chirchir kole kosib ko koimutyonoto kobit en lain ab kisumu moroni 132 kv power line kokotoi ke tetutik ab kewek kimnatet ab sitimet ole kakimuch kewek sitimanoto eng komoswek tugul en emoni koite koronet ab raini yesterday was caused by an overload uh, between kisumu moroni uh, when there was sudden uh, demand uh, and the line that between Kisumu and uh, Moroni is dimensioned to carry 80 megawatts. Uh, when the line went down, it was carrying 120 megawatts and suddenly there was a demand of an additional 20 megawatts on that line. Uh, for a line to be carrying 149 megawatts when it is designed for 80, it felt threatened and it dripped and cascaded down to the rest of the country. The power restoration started immediately, and by one in the morning, 60% of the customers had been restored. Kamwa chir chir kole koimutyen no ne koipchi kobe sitimet en emoni, kole taet ab kimnatet ab sitimet, olo mising ma nege le tago sir kamuk taet ab lai nega ab sitimet che miten en inguni. The transmission constraint is a challenge. Like if we need, for example, 200 megawatts in the western part of the country, the transmission links can only say carry 100 megawatts, to put it in simplistic term. And therefore, when the system tries to draw more power uh, to support the 200 megawatts, the line gives way because it cannot carry that capacity. Kosip kong noto, komwa chir chir kole, tatat ke te line da ne lel ne bara, ne bon narok po me 22 kv power line, ne imu che koi ma no, ne git ge su tek se nyin en aro ak tip tem che mi tanta, ase gi sto en ke goi mu te ka bete tap si te met en emoni. We are building a line, an alternative line to support west of Kenya through, from Olkaria, through Bomet, through Narok, sorry, Narok, Bomet, Bomet all the way to a window to be able to support the transmission that goes through Lesos, like I've mentioned, and therefore be able to remove the constraint. We require $5.3 billion to complete the entire master plan. What do we have this year? We have about $250 million in which we are going to implement the Narok Bomet link uh, to complete now what we call all carrier Narok Bomet to Sotik all the way. Then we are also going to do uh, Rumuruti, uh, um, Kabarnet to Rumuruti, and then we are also going to do uh, Marindi, Weru, Kilifi. Those three are, uh, will, will uh, require $250 million, which we have already acquired from AFDB. In World Bank. Kamwa chir chir kole, kite che kora keti soshek che menge chen ana substation che chuchu che ma negile to asimo ip kobe sitimet ene moni. What would need to be done instead of overloading a line and causing the whole country to trip, we would be able to remove some feeders uh, and therefore lessen the power demand that flows through a line and therefore be able to only carry the amount of power which the line can carry. The load shedding that you're talking about uh, will not be uh, a long-lasting effect, but is a short-term measure to ensure that we secure the country and we do not uh, have a national blackout because of uh, overloading of, of the line. Koyomis Chirchir, Nagamita, Nag Principal Secretary, Nagwaya Niger, Alex Washira, and Managing Director, Nagwaya Kenya Power, Engineer Joseph Siror Gulle, Kistoy Goy Muting Naba Bete Tabs Timet in Emoni, Kum Negid, Olego Gate Dog Ape Kokwau Tikya Ter Ter. Tinyago Mangunet Pigabe Moni, Kolewen Digo B to Walu Tikya Ter Ter, Kosip Kang Nagamwa CS Davis Tir Chirgole, Tinyabonga Nuting Ministry, Kobi Twalet, Osip Kok Bete Tabs Timet, Nogobet and Emmet. Aribotenjini Kast TV, Kongetentown Tam Nairobi, Kwane Elisha Pet.